Hi, my name is Yi Fan from Civil Engineering Department at Monash. Now I would like to show you around our visualization lab, and I can't wait to show you the exciting work and the cool gadgets we have here. Now first off, we have Jensen here testing a simulation program. So we're leveraging virtual reality and uh, reality capture technologies to create a really realistic scene for the crane operator to operate in a virtual environment. So in this way, the operator can uh, virtually rehearse a very risky job in a risk-free environment. To make the scene even more realistic, we're leveraging the laser scanning technology using this device. So the device will capture the 3D surrounding environment uh, within a very short period of time and with very high precision. So you can see the environment is enriched by the point cloud data. So the scene will be more realistic. And Jensen here is operating the virtual crane and we're setting all different mechanisms to identify the safety risks during this virtual uh, lift practice so that we can address these safety problems even before the actual lift take place. And uh, Jensen is using a very powerful PC virtual reality system. We also have the mobile virtual reality systems and also um, the HoloLens for augmented reality. So we're testing all these different forms of virtual reality and augmented reality, trying to understand how they can be used the best for the training purpose. All right, next up, we have Mustafa and Leo here um, trying to examine this massive 3D point cloud data, also collected by that laser scanner you saw just earlier. So here we're looking at a um, offshore platform. It's a massive structure. And uh, by leveraging this spatial data, we can, um, well, Mustafa, if you can show us the corrosion part. So we can closely examine the corrosion and paint condition of the bottom part of the structure. And uh, if you move to the drill tower, we can also using this data to assess the structural integrity of the most critical part of the structure on this platform. And uh, we can also understand the, um, yeah, the maintenance activities. So there are a lot of different materials lifted uh, to the platform for daily maintenance. And here we can view and optimize their layout on the very pre precious space on the platform. And we can also pull up the 360 um, image captured during the scan, so we can view we can view the scenario um, even more closer. And you can see we're taking advantage of this very big and high resolution screens, so that we can leverage its full capacity to view a massive data set like this. All right, thanks, Mustafa. Thank you.